Hi everyone, it's August 26, 2012. I'm Dwight Schmuck. This is the Schmuck Look. And today I'm talking specifically to a guy by the name of Jeff Kuda. He made a comment yesterday on my YouTube buying a presidency. And I'm going to read you his comment here. You are indeed disabled starting with your brain stem. You have become drunk on the commie Kool-Aid. And he spelled Kool-Aid wrong. With a, he did it with a C instead of a K. I don't know. Maybe he thought there'd be copyright infringement. I have no clues. At any rate. You know, I went to this guy's channel. He has no videos of his own. He's got, you know, some people on there who are, you know, a little to the right of Genghis Khan, perhaps. I noted the, the one guy he's got five or six videos of, some angry black guy, who's shooting the videos from his fucking van. Apparently his wife or parents won't allow him to do this stupidness in the house. And really... You know, Jeff Kuda, you are, in my eyes, what I would call a troll. I also noted a lot of the comments you've made to other videos, and they were all the ultra-right wing, I'll show the Tea Party how to be a Tea Party guy. A little, like I said, to the right of Genghis Khan. You know, what are you? You know, hoping and praying that when the money people really take over, why they'll, because you're a suck up, a sycophant, big word, I know, but try to, you know, go to the dictionary. I'm, I'm going to presume you have one. You could spell brain. I mean, come on, man. Get real here. There's a reason. A lot of reasons, actually, that we do have the regulatory laws in effect that we still do have. And, you know, most of that, you really ought to go read your history books. Back in the 1870s, 1880s, 1890s, we had what were called robber barons. And what these people did, realistically, was to buy up things, much as, you know, a lot of companies do today, like Bain Investments or whatever the hell it was, Mitt Romney's thingies. <clears throat> they buy up things and destroy them. Put a whole lot of people out of work or make them work for, as is being done now again, lower wages. Did you realize that in the last three years, well over 50% of the people who were laid off had to take jobs at 20 to 40% lower wages than they were making. Okay, now that's a loss of economy, isn't it? These people can no longer buy the goods and services they were buying, can they? Why, hell, they probably can't afford to pay their debts anymore, realistically. You get to choose this week. Should I go to the grocery store or pay my rent? Hmm, Jeff, that's really what this is and what it is coming to. I'm fucking 63 years old. Okay? 61, whatever. Yeah, 61. I'm not going to live that much longer, so I really don't see this affecting me that damn much. How old are you? Do you really think these people are going to take you along for the ride because you're sucking up in this manner? I noted you had no videos of your own. You don't put yourself out here, do you? Is that gutlessness stupidity perhaps it's just good old common sense but trolls are like that you'll run around making all these hateful statements getting off on having fun and oh yeah you get off because people like me respond
But as an American, I still have that freedom of speech. I'm allowed to respond to hateful, stupid people. And hateful and stupid were the key words there. Because if you're just doing this for fun, get another hobby. You know, whacking off in the bathroom might be a good idea. Remember to clean up. Mommy will like that. If this is done because you're really hoping the Koch brothers will take you along for the ride, you're already being taken for a ride. Get another hobby. Get something real. And really, Jeff Kuda, honestly, some of us ain't scared, like me. I come right out there and talk to you. Anybody else who watches this and wants to laugh, you're more than welcome. Hope you enjoyed the chuckle. But this is a guy who, like I said yesterday, put the first, the very first comment on my video, Buying a Presidency, and I said, you know, you're cordially invited to go screw yourself, because, like I said, I'm not above responding to idiots. I'm a schmuck. I'm a real one. Been one since the day I was born. I brag about it. I know how. Do you really want to play with a schmuck? Come on, Jeff. I slapped you now. You tried to slap on me. What you gonna do? Hey, folks, have a great day. Peace out there.